a B2B distribution or a manufacturing company, take a hard look at its culture. Why invest in culture before investing in technology and commerce? I think, I mean, it's very common, of course, for us not to give our culture much thought, especially, you know, if you're a, a smaller entrepreneurial organization, you're just fighting to keep alive. And then as you get bigger, you have, you know, lots and lots of things to think about. And, you know, trying to, to get a corporate culture going, that requires a big time investment. But I believe it is a very, very critical time investment. So what do we need to do? I mean, the same things we talked about at the beginning. We need to spend a good deal of time as a management team. What are the tough dilemmas? that our teams, that our managers are, are facing on a day-to-day -day basis or our employees are facing on a day-to-day -day basis. What are the really important ones to us, right? And how will we then guide our employees to make certain decisions when they're faced with those dilemmas, right? Don't choose 20 of them, choose three to start out with, right? The three most important ones. And then you need to talk about it a lot and debate it a lot. I mean, one of the things I saw at Netflix is that at every quarterly business review meeting, they have culture on the agenda. So they are constantly coming back and, uh, and debating it again and again. And I really believe that that is worth the time. Although I know it's, uh, it's easy to put it in the back of our minds. Thank <music> you.